Jay. Got my favorite SSR over there. He's got one. It's great stuff. Northbound on Eastern Avenue. Terrible herbs. One of the great, largest flags you can find in the area. It's pretty cool. If you're new here at the car show, we do this every Saturday morning right here. And we've got a new PA system, and I'm trying to figure out how to work it. So give me a second. <laughs> Good morning, folks. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light What so proudly we hear at the twilight's last gleaming Whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rockets red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there Oh, say, does that star-spangled banner yet wave for the land of the free and the home of the brave? Woo! Thank you, folks, Give it for being part of this car show. Thanks for donating today. Every Saturday morning, Kenny Miller, you're in charge, buddy. Okay, you say so. <laughs> What's happening, everybody? Welcome to Celebrity Cars and Coffee this morning. What's up, Eric? Morning. Morning, Shonda. Let's go see what's in the lot today. Hey, Steven. Pilot's in the house. What's happening, Pilot? We had a little bit of weather break today. Yesterday was freaking cold and nasty. We even had snow. You would never know it the way it looks out here today. That thing's slick. There you go, Shonda. We got the Jeep for you. What's up, Kevin? Good morning. Where are you at? No cars and coffee this morning? Oh yeah, they got the they got the drag race car out again today. There's Scott. I know, I'm working my way over there. <laughs> Well, we got a good crowd out here today, Kevin. It's uh, it's pet day today. Donate some pet supplies. Lots of animals walking around.
Oh yeah, that's burning my nose. It's gonna blow out my microphone. <laughs> Y'all got the idea, it's noisy. <laughs> Let's see what's out back here. Thanks for the super chats. Who gave super chats? Let's see, is it Alberto? It doesn't show me. I see Alberto super chat. Thanks for the super chat, guys. I appreciate it. Whew. Yeah. I had my ears ringing a little bit. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you. So sorry I didn't have a chance to turn on the camera Wednesday night, but it was an awesome night. What's up, LV Junk? So Hellcats threw a fundraiser for me and we raised like 20, I don't know, a little over $2,000. It was awesome. I'll be moving tomorrow. We're gonna do Rancho and Craig in the morning, but after that, we're finally moving into the apartment tomorrow. Hopefully I have a little less stress. That's a nice Mustang. See Kevin, we need to get you in one of those. Yeah, we part. Like I said, I got a truck reserved between 11 and noon tomorrow if anybody wants to come by. <laughs> Thanks. It's definitely a downsize, but it's a roof, you know. Morning, Steve. Here you go, Kevin. We'll get you some Mustangs. We get a lot of Mustangs over here. You should come and hang out with your peeps. I like the color on that one. No, unfortunately, I got a storage unit. We did that... Uh, Thursday, me and my son emptied out my garage for storage. The good news is the storage is right behind the apartment complex, so I could just walk out, go around the corner. Is that Ruby? I don't know. Oh, LV Junk, thank you so much for the super chat. It looks more like a maroon. Is that a ruby red? The Hot Wheels, they're in storage, unfortunately. Oh, well, it's the name of the car, but is, is that the color? Cool. What's up, flat four? All right, we'll work our way back to where we were at so they could turn on the music soon. In Philadelphia? Man, that would be fun. Maybe next year. Next year, after all this is crap is all over, I'll be able to travel again. And then I'll just be limited to vacation time I can take off from work. Because, man, it's been a long time since I had to work. 
<laughs> See, Kevin? More Mustangs, Kevin. Kevin, look. Mustangs, man. You gotta come down here with your car. Needham, what's up? Got another Kevin in the house. A whole Mustang aisle just for you. They all here, waiting for Kevin. Look at all those. We got the the hearse edition. They're always here, Kevin. Ever since they stopped doing the Shelby thing every Saturday, they all been coming here. I told you to bring your bring your car down. Yes, yeah, Vegas Valley Mustang. There's a Ferrari hidden back over here. No. Oh, there he goes. Four aisles down. The old Honda, right-hand drive Honda Civic. It's a righty. Beagle. <laughs> it's kind of cool. I like it. These guys came out Wednesday night. Appreciate it. Salty Land Speed Shop. What's up, G? Good morning. Happy Saturday. Finally got some decent weather. We got little Jeeps too, Shonda. Did I drive around a little bit? <laughs> Yeah, the trucks are awesome. What's up, Stuart? Good morning. He came out Wednesday. I'll uh, post up a couple of the videos that others took on the YouTube on the post sections on YouTube so you guys could uh, check out how Wednesday went down. It was pretty awesome, if you're interested. Nice 454 Stingray. Beautiful red. What is that? Is that a Citroen? Yep, it's a Citroen. I'll probably say it wrong, but that's awesome. I like it. Pretty cool. Got a truck for sale over here. Four speed on the column, yeah, that's pretty weird, huh? It's got the suicide doors too. Uh, I didn't see any rats this morning, unfortunately, Stuart. Should 
Shonda. I didn't see any rats. Not yet. It's an old timer. It's not a rat rod, but it's an old timer. We'll have plenty of rat rods next week. I dig it, dude. What's happening? <laughs> yeah, next. Here's yeah, next week. Yeah, next week is Rat City Ruckus. We got Welder Ups Open House. We're gonna be at on Friday and Saturday. We have Rat City Ruckus. I think Sunday we have a cruise. And Saturday, there's also the car show at Silverton. Here's to here. I won't be doing that. Rat rods all the way over Honda. <laughs> Yeah, so don't forget, folks, this is the biggest show of the year, Rat City Ruckus around here. All right, come on down. We're still here, having a good time. Got the rumblers out here. Phil brought out the rumbler. The rumbler, the rumbler. I love this car. Amazing, and I've only just begun. So Victor walks around here at the parking lot every week. Yeah, there's some awesome shows coming up, Stuart. Don't forget about Del Frisco's car show from one to four. Oh yeah, Kevin, I get you one of those too, man. Good pet drive over here. Got all kinds of dog food that they're donating, doggy beds. There's another one tonight over at Shelby. To bring your dog food, pet beds, blankets, whatnot, and go down to Shelby tonight for the same thing. No thumper here, not at this one. Thumper doesn't come to this one. It's too far. Cars and Coffees is 30 miles, 30 miles from uh, from another Sunday morning cruise. A lot of the guys don't cross don't cross town with their hot rods. There's a few that do, and many that don't. But we got the Starsky and Hutch car out here today too. Barry's car, the Hutch mobile. Uh, for Rancho and Craig, the another Sunday morning cruise is on the corner of Rancho and Craig. Every Sunday morning from 6.30 a.m. to 9.30 a.m. And this spot right here is Eastern and Ridgemar. 9500 Eastern Avenue. Yep. Huggy Bear. See, that's, the, that's actually the sweater that he wore in the movie. That's the real sweater from the movie. Supercharged Cherokee. There's another Mustang. Yeah, when the weather gets good, man. I know you guys still kind of got crappy weather. How was that earthquake, dude? What was up with that? They said they felt that shit all the way at uh, Yankee Stadium. Four, four, uh, what was it, a 4.1 or something? Did you guys see the Lincoln? I think it was in the thumbnail of the video, I'm not sure. 4.8? Oh, damn. That's crazy. Did they say what it was from? Did they, did they come up on any conclusions or anything? Because, uh, you know, New York don't don't be needing no uh, shaky ground, man. We don't need no buildings falling over. Wow. 
That's crazy. Police, police model. That thing's pretty badass. Slammed cop car. <laughs> you funny. The lucid's in the house. When we got copyrighted music. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's cool. Even got smart cars. And car shows here. Because the bug is down still. Haven't had any time to work on it. Look at that. Just a rare occurrence. Uh, hopefully it's very rare and doesn't happen again. I don't, I don't, I don't want to see those towers crumbling anymore over there. Look at that Cadillac. 1941. You like those, Shonda? Oh, they had bigger. That one looked kind of short, but. I don't know. I like them. Three wheeler. I love this El Camino. I love the demon. Morning. That's why I love this spot. We got a good mix of everything. Look at Mercedes just parked in the middle of everybody over here. <laughs> yeah, I haven't seen I haven't seen Doyle in a while. We may have lost Doyle. A bimmer. These are cool. We had one of these in the showroom. It's gone now. You guys didn't see? We got a Tesla truck. Anybody want a Tesla truck? It's not here, but we have it at Celebrity Cars. It's got 10 miles on it, and it's the Beast model. It's awesome. Well, it's fast. The tech is awesome. <laughs> hey, Victor. I know. I don't like the way they look. But it's it the tech is awesome, that's all I can say. Morning, morning. And for two hundred and fifty plus thousand dollars it could be yours. What's up, Gary? You working today? Tell Sherry I apologize, but I'm not going to be able to make it to the bull ring tonight. I'm going to be in the middle of packing. If I can sneak away, if I can sneak away, I'll come down, but uh, just give her a heads up. Move, move day is, uh, is tomorrow, Gary. Ooh, nice cobra.
That's if you're going to make it out to the bull ring yourself tonight, Gary. No, this thing's pretty badass. Morning, Saul. Mark, what's happening? Pack, packing Glocks and Nines. <laughs> I don't. I don't own a firearm as much as I would love one. I don't own one. I still know how to use my fists. The Turbo Beast. Oh. <laughs> you can open carry here. You can open carry here. If I if I walked around showing you waist high, you'd see how many people are actually carrying here. <laughs> How about a Bronco? You like the two-door Broncos? Remember the old Bronco 2s? I don't know if they were late 80s, early 90s, or it was just 80s, I'm not sure. We used to have them at Enterprise Rent-A-Car. They were hunks of junk. If they got too wet, the power door locks and windows started operating on their own. I hate detailing those cars. Totally anti-gun. Can you get a permit to carry there, Mark? Or no? Because New York's the same way. Like, citizens usually are not allowed. I know you can't go into the state. From a plane or have it in your luggage, man. They, get, they give you shit in New York for it. Woo! Sorry, gimbal's a little all over the place. You've got doggies roaming around. Look at the old Yamaha. SRX. I don't know what size that is. Yeah. What size is that? It's a 250. It's a 250? What year? 87. That's pretty cool, man. Yeah, 1987 250. Slick. <laughs> yeah, they only imported it that one year. <laughs> and, uh, I had friends that had the little 80 version, the Yamaha 80. They're hard to find nowadays. <laughs> yep. Supercharged. How's it going, Darth Vader? David's in the house. There you go, Kevin. There's a bright green one for you. I'm missing the VW show today. I'm so sad. This is the first VW show I'm missing in like five years. Just can't make it out. Yeah, so if you're local here and you're into the VW scene, Boulder, Boulder City's got uh, VWs invading the dam going on right now. And this is the bigger show compared to the last one I was at. Just have to wait again till next year when the bug's working again. Oh, 
Oh, I don't love this. Is the Skittles eye, all the all the rainbow of colors of Corvettes. It happens every year. Yep, it actually happens twice a year now, so it's pretty awesome. It's just been a while since I've missed that show. <laughs> <laughs> right at him. <laughs> Especially because, you know, we see all this stuff all the time. A lot of There's some new stuff here and there. But then you get to the VW show and it's like a whole different realm. I like these. A little small for me, but I like them. There's Roger and his brother's ride. The Nova. And the SS clone. He loves that little uh, American import. Oops. Oops. Nice Mustang. All right, brother. Take it easy, Stuart. Hopefully we, we're going to get some good footage at Rat City Ruckus. And I'm not even going to have my bug, bug there. So it's going to be fun, though. Red City Ruckus is off the hook. So is Welder Up. Friday at Welder Up. I think I'm just going to record there. Because I know a lot of y'all are working. Nice 240. What's up, cat? Frank's in the house. No, right now I'm having a loose head issue, I think. I've been through my exhaust and I've been through my valve. I've done my valve adjustment like three times. It still kind of sounds like it's spitting. Um, when I got under it and checked it out, cylinder number three, where the cylinder is touching the block, looks like it's leaking. So I'm assuming my head is loose. And it's above my tech. <laughs> It's above my knowledge, so I haven't been able to do that yet. My friend Noah said he's gonna help me out uh, via phone when I get settled, so we'll see. I just haven't had any time to mess with it as of now, so. There's a little bit too much going on at the moment. Yeah, I know what my carburetor issue is. It's Chinese. That's that's the issue I have with my carburetor. It's uh, it's leaky like a sieve at all the brass plugs that they used in it so i just need to get another carburetor but it's working for now and it's not leaking enough where i'm gonna catch fire so it's like a seepage but my buddy uh justin that i put on camera earlier with his rat bug he's having some serious carburetor issues he's having some serious running issues I just gave him another carburetor. Hopefully, uh, hopefully you get that one to work. That's a nice GT500. Beautiful car. Especially, especially with that under the hood. Ooh.
Look at this. That thing just barely fits in there. <laughs> What's up, Zach? Yeah. It is, bro, and it's an old it's an old ass building too. It's uh I don't know, I thought we got a deal compared to what the rates are here in in town and the area that we got in. I think uh, our total month uh, rent before our expenses utilities is thirteen fifty. So not bad. We're paying almost twenty eight for the house before utilities. So turning into mini California with the prices. <laughs> like the nice 57. Totally. We also had our, uh, my wife's son, my stepson was living with us and three dogs. So he took two dogs and himself and moved to Colorado. So it's just me and my wife now. First time since I've met her, uh, 2007, we are actually by ourselves. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> I, I don't know what it's like. I'm actually going to have to have conversations now. <laughs> you guys want the detail stuff. Got to come and get the detail stuff of Big Mike's. Look at all this What's cool up, stuff. Man? What's happening? <laughs> you guys will be able to get that stuff here. Thanks, buddy. For sure. We're going to have a promo code for them to get a discount on stuff. That'd be awesome. Well, it's a big walkthrough today. Not super, super crowded, but just enough. See, did we miss anything? We missed a couple of cars over here, like this flatbed truck. The Orange 55 came out Wednesday. That's Anthony's car. I want to thank everybody in this town for what they did for me. It's just awesome. And I'm so overwhelmed and, uh, and choked up. I, it, it, just a loss of words. This car community helped me raise over $5,000 to help me move. And it's awesome. Appreciate every single one of you. There's Johnny's, Johnny's Firebird right there. It's a beast of a car. Right, Zach? This is awesome. A lot of stress relief. Cheers to this entire town. And along with a lot of you that uh, do the super chats. It's, it helps out so much. YouTube doesn't pay nothing anymore. You know, before, everybody was so faux pas about talking about what they made on YouTube. Up until last year, I was making twenty-five to $3,500 a month just sharing videos. Now I'm lucky to cover my car insurance with the views. I mean, the views are still there. It's just YouTube's not paying. 
and it's ridiculous. There's Rich's truck. Yeah, so if y'all want to know what I was making last year, I was making between twenty-five and thirty-five hundred dollars a month just for just for watching, just from people watching. That's all. Now it's just a little over two hundred. So yeah. The tax man will come after me, but between all the Rat City ruckuses that I filmed, I've made over $20,000 on the Rat City ruckus videos. Watch out, here come the tax man. That's a Vander Hall. I don't know who sells the Vander Hall. I think some Mercedes dealerships have the Vander Hall in them. I'm not really sure. for sale 24,000 you can make out the phone number there folks you could have one of those too <laughs> I don't know they handle pretty good they were saying but I don't know it's like a two seat Can-Am <laughs> I pay the taxes I need to pay Another Doyle. <laughs> Another wrap on that one. Yeah, the rat rod, the rat rod videos is uh, it's what everybody liked. That's why they had so many views. I had over like five million views total on rat rod videos. Hey! <laughs> oh, right on. Follow me on the Facebook. Some more stangs. I like that color on the, I like the color of that one that we were looking at. That's it. I think we walked all the aisles. We walked them all. What's up, Tom? Good morning. Now, if the weather is like this tomorrow at Rancho and Craig for another Sunday morning cruise, we should have a good turnout. Check out the, the company man today. Got the work shirt on. Got the work hat on. We got to go to work now after this. So, well, I'll see you in the morning, folks. Thank you all for coming out and thanks for the super chats. But uh, we've seen it all today. So, I'm going to say goodbye until tomorrow. I'm going to make you dizzy as hell before you leave. I love y'all. Thanks again for the super chats and we'll see you soon, okay? Peace.